about those lane closures on 99 earlier today. A lot of those reopening because we've been lucky and stayed dry throughout most of the day here near Modesto where we are now. But as you can see here in rural Modesto over here on North Hart Road, obviously a lot of water flooding across the street here. As you can see, the Tesla taking his chances in driving through here. But as you saw from Kimberly's story, not the smartest, not the safest way to go about this. It's why Caltrans officials are saying to take it safe and turn around if you come across flooded waters across the road. The valley is prone to flooding, so this, this does happen sometimes uh, during heavy rains. Do not enter it. It's often deeper than it appears. Please turn around and find a different route. Hours after the rain stalls following a three day soak in the San Joaquin Valley, Caltrans officials in Stanislaus County aren't lowering the caution flag. This is the first major flooding um, event that affected our state highways for this season. California Highway Patrol issuing two traffic alerts Monday morning near Modesto. Lane closures on Highway 99 near Tuolumne Boulevard, where rainwater flooded over most of the southbound roadway. A big rig slamming into the center wall during the rainy commutes on 99 near Kansas Avenue. It did cause a lot of traffic impacts during the morning commute. There were also a few accidents in the area at the same time, a few spin outs. Aaron McQuarrie with Caltrans tells Fox 40 it's the first impactful flooding of the winter season affecting state roads in her district covering Stanislaus and San Joaquin counties. The valley is prone to flooding, so this, this does happen sometimes uh, during heavy rains. Especially on rural roads in the San Joaquin Valley counties. North Hart Avenue here just eight miles west of Modesto underwater near Shoemake Avenue. The flooding isn't making those behind the wheel any less daring. Again, back out here in uh, rural Stanislaus County, where we've had several more vehicles, as you're going to see another one approach this flooded uh, area of the roadway here in North Hart Road. We actually saw one vehicle earlier. A lot of them have actually made their way here pretty safely, pretty okay, which is against what Caltrans is advising. We saw one vehicle actually had to get towed out of here because it was such a low rise vehicle. So obviously don't taste the risk that uh, the street here provides. Find an alternate route home from work tonight. And there are still some road closures, still some lane closures out there here in Stanislaus County and other places in Northern California. You can check all of those by going to our website at fox40.com where we provide a link to an updated live feed of all the road closures, lane closures in Northern California that Caltrans provides on their website. Reporting live in Stanislaus County covering local news that matters. I'm Mason Morrow, Fox 40 News.